Hello and welcome. My name is Dylan and today I'm going to quickly show you guys two different ways that you can change the download default for your Steam games. So any any games or anything that you're downloading from Steam, so you want to put them on a specific storage uh, device on your computer. So for me, for example, my default storage device is an SSD drive because I installed Windows and stuff on there. But I want to put most of my storage on my hard drive uh, and keep the SSD for the things I just want to run really, really quickly. So uh, what you can do is you're going to click into whatever game it is. This is the first option. You're going to click install. When you click install, you're going to see choose location for install down at the bottom here. And you can see that it is install under um, hard drive or C, uh, storage system C. So I'm going to click the drop down menu here. And you'll see that it does actually show my other storage system. So create a new Steam library on drive D. So if you click on the bottom here, create a new Steam library on drive D. You go in here and you try to click uh, select. It won't work. So you're going to select a new folder. You're going to create new folder Steam library. You're going to select that folder. You're going to go ahead and select it. And now any games that I download off of Steam will go to this library or I can select that library. So now that we have done that, when I click install here, we're going to see install under C. And then we're going to click in here and we're going to install it under uh, drive D on more of my new Steam library and it will install onto that with the almost two terabytes there instead of the under one terabyte the 648 gigs on my ssd i just wanted to make a simple video just to show you guys how you could download your games onto different drives on your computer depending on space or how you have your computer set up so that you don't download download them into the wrong area and over clutter your ssd for example which the point of that is to run your program super super quickly so I hope this video helped. If it did, consider subscribing to the channel for a lot more content just like this. And uh, I hope to see you guys in the next one. Have a great day, everybody.